Remember the last engagement. It appeared that those ion cannon volleys are fired from this, Celis Taurus, a critical asset of children of fallen nation and the flagship for Jennifer Carrera, their second in command. Today, we'll sink the Celis Taurus and capture Jennifer Carrera. So please listen carefully. I am going to keep this brief as possible. The main weapon is the ion cannon in the bow. There's two BLS systems located on the ship's topside. But what's most dangerous about the battle frames is the anti-air missile systems located on both sides of the ship. The good news is, the system will take a while to activate. The ship has the ability to track multiple airborne targets and intercept multiple missiles at once. We expect that its missiles interception system is almost perfect. There's a high chance you'll encounter Jennifer in her personal battle frame a heavily modified M3. If you have to engage, we advise you to stay away from her machine gun range. That's all you need to know. I have to say this again. This is not an easy task. If the Air Force is the one doing this, they'll have to use an entire wing. Professor Iwata is away at his lab this morning. Hey, do we have to take Mariah out into combat? I know she's skilled, but she's just a kid. It's okay, Morgan. I can do this. My father implanted my brain with a receptor chip. And I've been training in the simulator since I was very young. I was built. I was born to pilot this frame. Your father? You mean Professor Iwata? Don't worry. I am fully capable of protecting my co-pilot. I am ready to accomplish the task at hand. She speaks as though she's more prepared for this than the soldiers over twice her age here. But she sounds so hollow. Emotionless. Somehow I feel kind of sorry for this girl. Like she said, she was born into this. She never had a choice, and she knows it. Let's just hope she believes in what she's fighting for. Once the data reaches the internet, like anything else, it's there forever. World, hear my words. Despite all the societal collapse, there are still people alive on the surface. I grew up there. Life is really hard. The contamination left most of the population sterilized. So kids like me are the last generation of the surface born. Born shortly after the wealthy built their flying cities. How are we supposed to get past that ion cannon? The Dachau is equipped with experimental cloaking technology. We can go invisible for a few minutes. The system generates tremendous heat, so there's a cooldown period after each use. Because of the heavy blizzard and barren landscape we're headed into, this is the perfect mission to put it to the test. Isn't the target area deep inside UCN territory? The target is miles outside any populated areas. Far enough from the terrorists think it's safe to hide in a large destroyer. We should be able to get in and out without any problems. Remember the last engagement. It appeared that those ion cannon balls
Ziplock, okay? Don't forget that Celis Taurus has an almost perfect missile interception system. Right, there are no weapons installed under the ship's belly, right? Affirmative, but engaging at close range is very risky. systems are destroyed. Only the ion cannon is left. It'll focus more on the ion cannon and usage, but don't worry. It's not designed to engage battle frame. There's a battle frame approaching at hypersonic speed. Damn it! Jennifer was not on that ship. One battle frame has done all of this. Jennifer has arrived. Do not take her lightly. She's a confirmed ace. Morgan, keep the distance. Don't let her in the machine gun range. Spamming missiles, huh? Show me some skill.
systems disabled. The pilot is safe. Main system will disengage from combat mode now.